everybody. Okay, previous lesson you have learned what is numbers, integer, rational number, irrational number, odd number, even number. And then we focus on decimal, percentage, standard form, and also fraction. So now we proceed to board mass rule. Okay, before we proceed to board mass rule, first look at the operation of numbers. First one is the sum of two numbers. The keyword here is the word sum. For example, find the sum of 3 and 5. So the solution here is 3 plus 5, which is equal to 8. Second operation here is the difference of two numbers. For example, find the difference of 8 and 2. So the solution here is 8 minus 2 equal to 6. Therefore, the difference of 8 and 2 is 6. Third operation is the product of two numbers. For example, Find the product of 3 and 4, therefore 3 times 4, which is equal to 12. And last one, the operation of numbers is the quotient of numbers. Quotient, okay. For example, find the quotient of 9 and 3, means you need to divide 9 with 3. The answer is 3. So, this is four operations of numbers that you must need to know. Okay, now, we proceed to board mass rule. We have heard what is board mass rule, secondary level, maybe. So, what is board mass rule? First, look at B. So, B stands for bracket. Then, O. O for off means power of, percent of, or maybe fraction of. Third is D. So D for division. And M for multiplication. A for addition. And S for subtraction. So this one, step by step, how you want to apply board mass rule without using calculators to solve the question. So, refresh back. B here. Then O. Then D, M, A, S. So that one is board mass. Let's look at first example. So this one based on first example. Look at here bracket. B here bracket. So 15 divided by 3. You got 5 here. Then next step. How to solve the question. Still in bracket but here negative 4 times 5. So you got 20 here. Negative, positive. That's why negative 20. Next, still in bracket. So you got negative 30 here. Then, positive 2 times negative 30. So you got negative 26. And last one, final answer for first example is negative 28. So this one, step by step, how you solve the question without directly using calculator. Okay, so now proceed to second example, this question. Okay, first look at in the bracket. So here, 3 square, negative 2 to 5, divide by 5. 
So first look at here. 3 square equal to 9 and then negative 2 to 5 divided by positive 5. You got negative 45. Okay, next step here is still in bracket 2 times 9. So 2 times 9 equal to 18. Positive, positive, positive value. Okay, next step here is 18 minus 43. So you got negative 25. Next step here is negative 7 times negative 25. So equal to positive 175. Therefore, final answer equal to 184. So this one is example 3, long question, but the step by step under board mass rule is still same. So look at here, bracket, and then you got 5 minus 6 equal to negative 1 here. Okay, next step, negative 30. Divide by negative 15. So, negative, negative, positive value. And then, here. So, here is negative 1 power is 3. Therefore, negative 1. Okay. Next step. Negative 2 times negative 1. So, negative, negative, positive value. Next step here is you solve in the bracket. Negative 9 plus positive 2 plus 2. So, negative 5 here. Then, here, positive 17 times negative 5 equal to negative 18. Therefore, final answer equal to negative 89. So still, you can check final answer here, negative 89 and then for second example, final answer equal to 184 using your calculator. Key in directly original question at the end, final answer equal to 184. For second example, meanwhile, for example number 3, key in directly in your calculator original question, find answer equal to negative 89. Example number 4, long question but still easy if you follow step by step under B O D M A S bot mass rule. So look at the solution. So first step here. Negative 3. How? From this bracket. 3 minus 6. So equal to negative 3. Next step here is the difference between first step and second step solution. Here, 9. So, 9 here means negative 3 squared. So, negative 3 times negative 3. So, positive value. So, negative 3 squared equal to 9. Third step of solution here. Negative 18. So, negative 18 come from here. Negative 2 times 9 equal to negative 18. Meanwhile, positive 3 here based on negative 30 divided by negative 10. So negative, negative, you got positive value. Okay, next step. Here, negative 18 means you solve in the bracket. Negative 3 
minus 18 plus 3. So, equal to negative 18. Next, final answer equal to negative 41. So, here negative 36 is based on positive 2 times negative 18. So, at the end, final answer negative 41. You can check this final answer using calculator directly key in the original question then check your final answer okay then this one is example 5 so look at first solution first type of solution here is 2 so how to from this bracket 5 minus 3 then here 3 5 minus 2 here then 16 so 16 here is based on 4 square okay next step you solve this one negative 2 divide by 2 so negative positive negative value then 3 square here so 3 square equal to 9 okay next step focus in the bracket focus in the bracket you got negative 9 so negative 9 comes from negative 1 times 9 next step bracket 4 minus 9 here so 4 minus 9 you got negative 5 solve the 2 times negative 5 you got negative 10 negative 10 from 2 times negative 5 and then plus 16 at the end final answer equal to 6 same procedure, you may check your final answer using calculator. Substitute or key in the original question. At the end, make sure your final answer equal to 6. Okay, if you follow board mass rule step by step, B, O, D, M, A, and last one is S, you may solve the question easily. Hey okay guys, now it's time to check either you understand or not how to apply board mass rule. For example, using this self-review question without using calculator, evaluate and express your answer in the simplest form. So, we call back board mass rule to solve this question. But remember, you may check your final answer using calculator. Okay guys, that's all for today. Next, we'll focus on linear equation. Bye-bye!